Hi, I'm Chess, and you're watching Chess's Crazy Creations. Today we're gonna cover a bunch of dusting hacks. Now let's get started. Now let's talk about lampshades, and you can easily use a lint roller to clean these off easily. Now, if you want to be more eco-friendly, you can use a reusable lint brush as well. You can find those at the dollar store. Now this next dusting hack works for any light bulb. So simply take a damp washcloth and wipe off your light bulb. Now you can also use a damp microfiber cloth as well. And the one thing that's important is make sure that the light bulb has been off and cool before you touch it and don't turn it on right away. You wanna make sure it's completely dry before using it. Now let's talk about baseboards and you don't wanna break your back. So one of my favorite things to do is use my vacuum cleaner and the extension on it. So I simply just clean the baseboards with this. In addition to that, I can get the cobwebs down with this extension as well or hide reach places like above doors or above windows and you just simply suck it off and it's really easy. You have one item that cleans everything. But if you don't have a vacuum cleaner that can do this easily, well, you can go grab one of these little Swifter things at the dollar store and add one of your used dryer sheets to it. Simply wipe your baseboards off with that dryer sheet and the dust clings to it. And then when you're done, throw that dryer sheet away. In addition to that, We'll talk about blinds. You can use your vacuum cleaner extension to just vacuum off your blinds. Super, super easy. And if you don't have a vacuum cleaner that can do this easily, take an old sock, maybe one that you don't have a match for anymore, and you can use this to simply wipe down the blinds as well. The other thing it can do is get right in between each of the blinds for a little extra cleaning, and you can also make them damp so that it cleans them even better. And the great thing about something like this is you can wash and reuse it again and again. Now, you can reuse dryer sheets as well to clean monitors, computers, TVs, and more. It creates the static cling that pulls that dust off of those. If you don't wanna use something like that, you can go back to the sock and you can easily wipe off any of those computer surfaces or TV surfaces with the sock as well as dust anywhere. And then once again, throw it in the wash and you can reuse it. And then of course, you can always use your vacuum cleaner. Just take the short extension and go ahead and vacuum all the dust off of all of those surfaces as well. Another one of my favorites is a damp cotton cloth. This just scoops the dust right off of many surfaces and you can wash and reuse. You can also use a damp microfiber cloth if you prefer that. One of my favorite things about these is that I can wash them and reuse them again. And then I also like to use coffee filters to dust as well. Now, when it comes to ceiling fans, we don't wanna wipe them down and get that dust everywhere. So I take an old pillowcase, I slide it on carefully, and then I pull over the blade so that the dust gets trapped inside the pillowcase. I repeat this process, and then I can easily wash the pillowcase when I'm done to use again. Now let's talk about all the vents you have in your home. You can use an electronic duster and blow out the dust. Another option would be to use a damp bristle paintbrush or a foam paintbrush that's damp and wipe those vents out. The dust comes right out. You'll be amazed and then you can wash and reuse. Another option would be to use a toothbrush. When it comes to all of the computers in our home, I like to take some rubbing alcohol and then dip my Q-tip in it and wipe off all the keys. In addition to that, I put a little bit on a microfiber cloth and wipe down all the surfaces to just clean it and get all the dust off of it, but then also disinfect it as well. And don't forget about your broom. You can clean off cobwebs from the top corners, but you can also wrap it in a microfiber cloth and clean baseboards as well with it. It also works great on your blinds. So I'm also a big fan of these reusable dusters that are at the dollar store, and we like these dusting mitts as well. You simply use them and dust, and then you can throw them in the wash and use them again. And I hope this inspires you to try some dusting hacks of your own. I'd love it if you'd subscribe to my YouTube channel and my blog at chatscrazycreations.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.